In this video, we will review SiriusXM's fish mapping weed line information using a Garmin display. Let's start by clicking on the fish mapping icon on the home screen. After clicking on the fish mapping icon and selecting menu, you will see three tabs listed at the top of the screen. When the top tab is selected, the fish mapping menu is available. By clicking on the layers menu, you can access the fish mapping features. The fourth button under the layers will give you access to the weed line features. Weed line information is updated every 24 hours. Select weed lines and press menu to view weed lines on the full screen. Zoom out until you see magenta or purple colored areas of various shapes. These areas indicate where weed lines can be found. You may then want to zoom in to a specific area where weeds are shown. This layer allows you to view areas with the most prominent floating algae and weeds. Weeds provide nutrients and cover and become natural habitats for baitfish, shrimp, crabs, and other organisms that attract larger predatory game fish. Weed lines are identified using satellite imagery and are based on a variance of the reflectivity of the water. This imagery identifies the more defined weed lines that have formed into a dense mat. Weed data is provided for our entire coverage area. However, due to potential interference close to shore, weed lines from shore out to about 25 miles often cannot be accurately determined and will not be displayed. Also, the image shapes shown are not the exact representation of what you will find. Oceanographers review the image captured by satellite then draw contour lines around areas that are determined to be weeds. A few things to keep in mind. The ability of satellites to detect weed lines may be impacted by cloud cover or other occurrences. Weed lines can also appear and disappear from one day to the next due to wind, waves, and other factors. Weed lines are constantly moving. We recommend that you monitor current and wind information to better determine how the weeds may have moved since the time the data was recorded. For these reasons, we include three days worth of weed imagery. To display all the days, go to the main fish mapping menu. Tap the loop button and then press menu to return to the full screen. With the loop on, the most recent three days of weed line data will be shown in sequence. The legend in the top left corner will identify which day is being shown on screen during the animation. In addition to the day, notice how the shade of these weed lines transitions from light to darker, representing past to present weed line data. You can also click on any weed line area to get a time that this particular weed line was updated. For additional information and videos, please visit our fish mapping website at SiriusXM.com forward slash fish mapping. For videos specific to your brand of display, visit our marine video library at SiriusXM.com forward slash marine library. And for even more about using SiriusXM Marine, visit our YouTube channel at youtube.com forward slash SXM Marine. In addition, please follow us on our social media sites. If you have questions, feedback, or would like to share a story, please email us at marine.support at SiriusXM.com. If you have specific questions about your Garmin hardware, please email marine.training at garmin.com. Thanks for watching.